Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing good and you all are safe at home. So, if you're watching me for the very first time, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel. I mean, continue watching this video and if you like my content, do subscribe it because I really put a lot of efforts and I just want a subscription from you guys. That's it. It really really means a lot to me. So, yeah. I'm going to share this beautiful pink soft glam makeup look with you guys. It's a very pretty makeup. I think this is one of my favorite makeup as festive season is so near. I mean it's still uh, going on but Diwali is coming soon. So I think this makeup look is really going to help you in a lot of ways. I think it's not about Diwali and festive seasons only. Whatever occasion you want to wear this makeup, you can just go ahead and uh, do it it's very easy it's very simple but at the same time it's very pretty i don't know it just gives like it just makes you feel more elegant and more beautiful so yeah without any further ado let's get into the video so guys i'm already done with my skincare so if you want to know what i generally use for my skincare i will leave the link in the description box below or also you can click on the i button and you will directly go to the video so i'm gonna start off directly with the primer so this one is the new one this one is from nika so yeah i'm just gonna use it just a very you know very small amount it's a silicone based primer so i'm just gonna rub it like this and just gonna apply it honest if you will ask me about this primer this primer does it jobs i mean it just blur out the pore and also it just gives a very nice smooth base for your foundation so yeah i think you can go for this primer i'm absolutely in love with this one use this concealer so i have this new concealer from maybelline sorry for this hair so yeah i have this new concealer from maybelline so i'm in the shade 40 caramel so this is their fit me wala collection and yeah so i'm just going to apply it That I'm gonna directly put this foundation. Sorry for looking that weird. So I'm using the Nykaa Skin Filled Anti Pollution Foundation. I'm in the shade 12 True Toffee. Again, it's the perfect match. So yeah. I forgot one thing. I usually mix my rose hip drops with the foundation, but I forgot today. So let it be. But you can if you want a dewy finish. So yeah, and I'm gonna blend it together. And don't worry. like the finish of this foundation and also the coverage is good and also the concealer is pretty good so i can barely see my spots although it is visible but if you will see it very closely then you can see it otherwise yeah good coverage a new product so many new products for today's video so this one is again a concealer stick concealer and foundation stick from ny bay and this is in the shade golden nyb FCS3 uh, in the shade Grander Than Central, such a long name. I will leave the link in the description box below. So this is not my shade. It's lighter than my actual shade. So I use this for my highlighting purpose. And it's very affordable, very creamy, I can say. So I just use it here, like, and here. A little bit on my eyelids, like over my eyelids. Just, you know, for highlighting purpose. Yeah, so this sets very, you know, jelly. So, you need to blend it out. So you can see, I have blended it nicely. It just creases fast. That is the only, uh, you know, what uh, cons about this product. Otherwise, this is a good foundation stick and it's very affordable. I think it's under rupees 100 and still with good ingredients. So yeah, I think you can give this a try. Turn it down a little bit. I'm going to use this Color Essence Compact in the shade Dusky. So this will just match my tone. I know a lot of steps. So I'm going to use the Johnson's Baby Loose Powder. You can use whatever you want or you can just not do this step. The so the next step is uh, eyebrow. So I'm gonna use this Etude House 
drawing eyebrow in the shade 02 I guess I will leave the link in the description box below so make sure you check it out so just comb it out and fill in the sparse area that's what I do because I have naturally thick eyebrows and I don't think I really need to do a lot on my eyebrows so yeah pretty much done with my eyebrows so you can just clean and carve out the edges for more cleaner and sharper look so for saving time I just use the foundation brush and just do this you don't have to do it blush my all-time favorite sugar blush this is in the shade 03 mauve marvel so yeah I need in my life and now I will just set my whole base with this face mist our eyes so I'm gonna use this only palette this one is Nykaa's palette in the shade daydreaming such a beautiful and pretty palette it is I mean it has all the colors which I genuinely love and need in my life I think you can just have this palette and create so many looks and like you can create party looks also because it has some sort of very new shade like this one and this one so they are very nude so you can just wear it on daily basis also so yeah I think it's a must have always start with a clean brush uh, I know my brush seems a little bit dirty and pigmented but I swear I wash my brushes uh, every week but I was just too lazy to wash them yesterday so yeah but make sure there is no pigment with that pigment which you want to put on your eyelids and that will just look so bad so yeah I know you are getting this my point. very nude and I think this is the lightest shade on this palette so yeah all over my crease with this fluffy brush so it gives a little bit of kickbacks and fallouts so make sure to do this and yeah start it always do this thing like always just try to pick the color like here like swipe it up to here like a wing so that will just give you more nice and nice shape basically and just start blending little neon pink color and this one is darker than this color so yeah focus like I'm gonna put this color place this color only on the outer corner I don't know if you can see or not but oh you can see I guess there is a clear gradient sort of effect I'm just to blend it out really plays a important role in your eye game so try to pick accurate brushes for the area so yeah you will get a good eye makeup yeah I'm happy with I'm pretty much happy with my eyes so now I'm gonna do the cut crease I'm gonna put a glitter shade so I'm gonna pick this white or uh, pinkish sort of a shimmer or glitter whatever you want to say and just place it directly on my eyelids where I have applied the concealer it has a you know lot of pink in it use this finger for the corners pretty much happy with my both the eyes and now I'm gonna do my lower lash line so I'm just picking up this uh, pink color again and on a flat brush also I'm blending it with the lighter shade so that it will look more blended and smudged out use my eyeliner so I'm using this Lacme insta liner it's my all-time favorite so yeah
is done. I know it's different, but yeah. So now I'm gonna curl my lashes. white kajal if you have a nude kajal then just go ahead for the nude one i have the white one so i'm gonna stick to the white one so this one is the big apple of my eye coal this is again from the company ny bay so yeah it's very creamy and it comes in this retractable form so yeah it's a good kajal for its price so i'm just gonna put it I think that's pretty much it for the eyes and the only thing which is left is lips and uh, highlighter. So yeah, I'm using this Wet n Wild Makeup Stick Highlighter. This is in the shade when the nude strikes. I'm just going to put a little bit here. A little bit here. I have used this beautiful lipstick from NY Bay again. I love this shade and lipstick particularly. So this is in the shade Sinfled Away 13. So yeah, it's a very nice brown chocolatey nudish color. Very pretty shade and also very moisturizing. And with that, I think my makeup is complete and I'm very happy with the final look. it for today's video guys i hope you liked it and i hope you found this makeup tutorial helpful everything whatever the product i have shown you in this video i will give the link in the description box below please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the notification bell icon because i'm really putting my efforts and trying to put video every week so yeah don't forget to do that and yeah till then stay happy stay safe and thank you so much for watching me